first team, and just for reference, we are going in alphabetical order. Um, we are going to be talking about the Arizona Cardinals. So, before we get to the fun facts, we are going to talk about their drink. I'm realizing this now that, and this will apply for all future videos, I probably should have found out more reasoning as to why these drinks are related to each team. Um, but I know with all the drinks I chose, they have something to do with the city. I kind of just Googled which drink is, um, you know, the most popular in this state or city or according to the football team. Um, and so when it comes to the Arizona Cardinals, I was able to select So, with that said, we are going to be making a prickly pear margarita. So, what that consists of is, obviously, tequila, triple sec, prickly pear mix, lime, sweet and sour. Um, but something that is different that I learned as a bartender that I like to do with my margaritas is I like to put in orange juice. So some things I learned along the way is um, putting just an ounce of orange juice, I'm sorry, not an ounce, a quarter of an ounce of orange juice into margaritas. So I will be also adding orange juice. So let's start and talk about Arizona. So, some of the fun facts that I learned about Arizona is that the Cardinals became a franchise on September 17th, 1920. And I am pretty much a pretty big sports fan, but something I didn't realize is how far back, and I don't know why, I just never really thought about it, like how far back that football goes. Um, and I thought that was a pretty interesting fact, but some of y'all probably already knew that. Um, Another fact, the next fact on my list, is that the Cardinals won the NFL championship in 1925 and 1974. Um, the first Cardinal to be elected to the Hall of Fame was F.B. And please, bear with me. Names, English, speaking, in general, which I don't know why I do this, because of my issues with pronunciations. Forgive me for any names I may butcher. Uh, feel free to try and correct me in the comments, but given that I don't think there are speaking comments, good luck. Anyway, so the first Cardinal to be elected to the Hall of Fame was F.B. Ernie Nevers in 1963. So, this one's a long one, so I'm gonna pause. Let's go ahead and put the lime juice in here real fast. So, next on my list is that Ernie Nerve scored all 40 points during a 1929 Thanksgiving Day game when the Cardinals beat the Chicago Bears 40-6. to This NFL record still stands, and nobody has been able to beat it. So, with that said, I did get these facts off of, you know, online, Googling and all that. Um, I'm not sure how old that is or if that record is still true. So, for the purpose of my facts in this video and everybody's kindness, we're going to pretend it is. Um, and hope that it still is. Because, you know, who wants to... I hope everybody saw the orange juice. No. No. Squirt everywhere. Um, anyway. <clears throat> well. Let's uh, continue. But anyway, so yeah. Um, and then lastly, in 1932, again, a name, Charles W. Bidwell bought the Cardinals. William V. Bidwell is the owner and chairman today. The team ownership has stayed in the family since Charles bought the team in 1932. I think that's pretty cool, keeping it in the family, um, you know? So a pretty interesting fact, the more you know. So let us finish off this delicious smelling even. Oh my gosh, this might be my new favorite. 
margarita that I'll never be able to find and have to make by myself. thought this was gonna be brighter I really really did think that was gonna be brighter but it's pretty light let's see hundred percent 10 out of 10 new favorite margarita I will list all the facts below I will not be citing them simply because I had 32 teams to go through and forgot to start citing about, you know, 30 teams in. Um, and then I will also be posting the uh, drink recipes along in the description. Sorry, my brain stopped there for a second. So thank you guys so much. This is fun and stay tuned for the next episode. Bye.